This morning, we've got uh, tennis legend chef Ed Brown here, <laughs> one of the best names to say if, if you're a broadcaster in the tennis world. Now, uh, Ed, you've been running Aces, the fine dining there at the U.S. Open. For how long have you been doing this? Just about a quarter century. Wow. Just just getting warmed up. And what, what, where are you right now? So next week it gets kicked off, and what's going on at Aces right now? So we're warming up. Uh, Aces lives for 14 days of the year. Uh, it's just an incredible event. So we serve thousands of people in 14 days. Um, we've also got Champion Steakhouse out there by Benjamins. Uh, and some of the most amazing food in the country happens in such a short period of time. Right. And so you're going to do some salmon for us today. Yeah. You also have a cocktail. Our pickle ballers are back in, sweating. They're at the dining, the fine dining uh, Aces oh, table here at you. Studio 1A. Let's get right to it, Ed. Good, we got good. some cucumbers here. we yeah, got about so four if, minutes. So I've got some Persian cucumbers. Okay. I love these small Persian cucumbers because they're very fragrant. Mm -hmm. So I just split it. Cut it on a bias, little half moons. Don't need to take those seeds out because they're very easy to eat. I've got some julienne fresh ginger, mm -hmm. very fragrant. And ultimately, what are you making right now? Like a slaw that's going to go on top of it's, the... It's, it's a bit of a slaw, and we're going to make a pesto that goes with it after. Mm -hmm. Pinch of salt and pepper. Do this like 20, 30 minutes in advance. The vinegar and the salt will start to cook the cucumbers just a little bit. Mm -hmm. See how fragrant those cucumbers Beautiful. are? Beautiful. Bocajete or uh, just a grinder. I've got toasted pumpkin seeds in here. Mm, yum. Give them a quick grind. You can do this in a spice grinder. You can use a bottom of a heavy pan mm -hmm. on, a, on, a, on a towel. And just grind these up a little bit. And I'm going to dump some into our salsa. Do you get any of the tennis pros coming into Aces? So we also feed all the players. Oh, you do, yeah. So what we get is a lot of... Uh, uh, some of the former stars yeah. who are there visiting come in will come in and, nice. and, and have dinner. Are we feed gonna, the players in a separate area. Is that parsley you're going to add? This is fresh mint. Mint. Again, summer, fragrant, mm -hmm. lots of mint, mint grape, basil, chervil, a pinch of olive oil. Beautiful. And a little Parmesan cheese. And I know I'm going to take some grief that I'm putting cheese with fish. That's all right. And it's it's one of my it's one of my personal rules that I don't put fish with, with uh, cheese with fish, but I think it really works in this case. Is it working? Is it working? It's great. Really good. It's solid. Delicious. Good. There's so many flavors going on, and they all work. Chef, talk to us about the salmon when you go buy salmon. And there's Atlantic, and there's Scottish, and there's sockeye, and there's this. And that. What do you use? So first what of do you all, like? first of all, first thing you want to do is be is buy fresh salmon, and you want to buy sustainable, uh, where possible salmon. And so you got to ask questions. So you got to ask where is it from, uh, how is it raised. Unfortunately, there's a lot of controversy about uh, signage. So ask, ask your fish purveyor and ask them, where is this salmon from? How is it raised? Okay. I like using a sustainable farm-raised salmon. Yeah. I mean, obviously wild in season. That season is very short. Everybody thinks you buy that all year long. Right. Where are these from? This is from Faroe Island in the North Atlantic. Okay. Great sustainable farming practice. And you're going to go flesh side down, huh? Flesh side down. So you can tell that was the skin side. And these are skin. Removed. The skin's been removed. Skin is off. All right. How's the salmon, gang? Oh, my God. I mean, we're almost yeah, there. A little olive great. oil was <laughs> down first. <laughs> it's a little olive oil. And you're going to cook the whole thing in the pan. You're not going to finish it off. The whole thing in the pan, several minutes on each side. You can hear it's, it's sizzling, but it's not ripping hot. It's going to get in here. Yeah, these have been already seared. I'm going to go on top of that cucumber salad. Oh, man, that's delicious. So this salsa awesome. on mm. wow. Some of that salsa, salsa is killer. And the salad yeah. That is killer. Mm -hmm. Fresh, light, summertime salmon. What well, about sure. this cocktail? Let's get to that before we Let's run out of time. Let's get to the cocktail. The Honey Deuce. This is The Honey the Deuce. Cocktail. This is like the mint julep of it's the it. U.S. Open that you've created. I love that. How many of these do you sell next week? A couple hundred thousand. Whoa. A couple hundred oh, thousand. We got our, we got good, our thing a, good thing there's a train right it, nearby. What's in it? What's in it? So it's Grey Goose Vodka, Lemonade. And we top it with a little bit of Chambord. Chambord. Oh, that's what it is. And wow. those little tennis balls, oh melon, honey melon balls. Really? This is dangerous. Imagine having a gig just is... doing the honey, the melon oh. balls. <laughs> the kids sitting there all day. Chef, thank you. Good luck next week. By the way, we have some other beautiful items here. You want to quickly just run down Lobster those? salad with mango and avocado. And a, right off the, the Aces menu? Yes. Heirloom tomatoes beautiful. and fresh mozzarella. Oh, and, of course, my signature crab cake that I've probably made on this show for yeah. probably 28 years. Mm -hmm. These recipes today.com slash food. Chef, thanks so much. Good luck next week to Pleasure, you. Pal. We'll come and see, see you. you. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.